Hi, my name is Tony Granados, and I'm the executive director of the LEAP Foundation. We're a Los Angeles-based program for youth leaders. Here, I learned how to actually write the grants, to take the action, and to take what we do and put it into a package that gets funded. It sounds so simple, but you really have to follow the systems that Rodney's sharing because they work. And at LEAP, we say it's smarter to copy genius than create mediocrity. And after this event, I definitely can do that. The foundation of what grant writing really needs to be, you will be well on your way. In fact, in less than four and a half hours, I'm going to share with you what a lot of grant writers have been writing grants for a while still don't do in their grant writing process. You can take this Hi, I'm Katrina Carmichael with Friends of Tulare County, and I am definitely going to use some of the tips that I learned today. These program officers are simply representing those, those concepts and those ideals that those who have formulated this foundation that they want to continue to give to. So we want to know that you can't get that always through written text or what you simply see on the website. So when we talked about the part of being well researched earlier, we're talking about researching the website, researching their guidelines, we're talking about researching their 990s. So we want to know them, we want to, we want to Google them. I had no idea that if I look at their 990s, I can see what types of groups that they've already funded. And I should know that because my own organization we do the same thing with our 994, and I didn't think anyone would look at that either. So we want to make sure that our proposal is well written and well designed. That's one of the hints that I'm telling everyone, make sure you do. Do your research and look at who they funded in the past because they may fund you in the future.